Hello everyone. In this video session, I am going to practically demonstrate one of the Selenium WebDriver commands that is get first selected option command. So what is the purpose of this command? Let me explain. For example, we have a web application. On this web application page, there is a multi selection box field. In this multi selection box field, we can select multiple options. Let's say I want to select multiple options inside this multi selection box field in a particular order. Let's say I would like to select Audi option first, then Volvo option next, and then Hyundai third. So Audi is the first option which got selected, right? But if you use this Selenium WebDriver command known as get first selected option, it will not retrieve Audi option. Okay, this is a confusion, guys. A lot of people will get confused here. We think that since Audi option is selected first, this command may retrieve the Audi option first. You will you will think like that, but it will not happen. Then how this particular command will work? This command, when used, will scan this multi selection box field from top to bottom. Okay, after these options are selected in particular order or whatever the order it is, it will scan these options from top to bottom. So when it comes from top to bottom. Volvo is the first option which is coming in the list, guys. Even though multiple options are selected, when it when this particular command check this option selected options from top to bottom, Volvo is the first option. So this command will retrieve the first selected option from top to bottom of this multi selection box field. That is nothing but Volvo option. Let me prove this practically to you. Here we have some sample automation code which will open the Chrome browser, then maximize it, then open the application. Right? Once the application is open, it will look like something like this. Now, now the thing is, I need to first select Audi option, then Volvo, then Hyundai. How to select these options? For that, we need to create an object for the select class. Select select is equal to new select. Before I demonstrate this command, get first selected option command, we need to first select the options case. Okay, this cannot, this command cannot be demonstrated directly. In order to demonstrate this command, first we need to select the options. Let's say I will select this Audi option first, Volvo and Hyundai third. Okay, so let's do that. So for that, I will create this uh, object for the select class over the mouse on select and import this from Selenium library. This constructor cannot be empty. You need to pass the web element of this multi selection box field to this constructor. How to do that? So for that, I will inspect this multi selection box field like this. The HTML code of the multi selection box field will be displayed like this. Displayed like this. Inspect this. You see the HTML code of the multi selection box field. It has some ID. Copy this ID, attribute value of this multi selection box field, and create a web element here. Driver dot find element by dot id provide the id attribute value of the multi selection box field. This find element will return the web element. Here I'll name the web element as multi selection box field. Okay. So when I hover the mouse on multi selection box field, it will return web element. Okay. This will return web element. So just hover and say create local variable. It will create the web element. Now this is the web element for multi selection box field. Copy this and provide that in the select constructor. The error will be gone. Now, using the object reference of the select class, I'll say select dot. I have to first select the options. I want to select the Audi option first. For that, I'll say select dot. So select by visible text. So here, I'll give the option as Audi first. Okay, visible text Audi. Then the next option I want to select is Volvo option. Okay, for that I will say select dot. Select by visible text. Here I'll give Volvo. Now third option, select dot, select by visible text. Here I'll give Hyundai. So first option I am selecting as Audi, then Volvo, then Hyundai. H Y U N D I. Okay, Hyundai. That's fine. Now guys, once all these three options are selected in some particular order, now using the select object reference, if I say select dot. Get first selected option. This command, get first selected option command, will return which option, guys? Audi or Volvo? Volvo, guys. As already explained, Volvo is a. Even though three options are selected from the top, it is Volvo. It doesn't matter which option you selected first here. It matters from top to bottom which option is kind of selected. That is Volvo. This will be returning Volvo. So you see, one web element will be returning. That is element. I will say for the mouse, create local variable. Now let me print the. Text of this web element. How to print the text of this web element? How to say element dot get text. When I say web element dot get text, if I inspect this Volvo option, you see this is the element of this uh, HTML code of this Volvo element. It has some text between the text. This text will be retrieved and printed. 
okay this particular text of this uh, web element will be retrieved and printed so it should print volvo guys not audi okay let's see that in action right click run as java application even though audi option is selected first volvo will be written because in the drop down from top to bottom volvo volvo is coming first so let's see that whether volvo will be printed or not you see volvo got printed so guys hope you understood how to use this get first selected option and uh, which option get first selected option will be returning so that's it guys thank you bye